quite carrying on the walk. The hill fort's over there. I've just come from down there. Up there, down there. In the Robo Warren. What's going on in the world? Well, we've got a general election for the 12th of December in the winter. Um, it's uh, something, it's all very messy with Brexit as well and people wanting referendums and it's all very, very messy, I'm afraid. And uh, it'll probably result in what's called a hung parliament where the present Prime Minister can't get enough support or it's very much the fulcrum is balanced or unbalanced something and uh, we have to then another government has to be formed and it would could be a coalition with the Libs and the Labs Liberals and Labours might and the SNP and the DUP might all join up against the Conservative Tory party which have been acting abominably it's even to their own MPs They've dismissed them. They've, oh, I've got, honestly, it's disgusting what's been going on. Bullying tactics. Um, copying Trump type rhetoric as well. Um, with Boris Johnson. So, right now over there, I've just spotted something. I mean, it's a ladder going up a tree. Now, why would that, why would there be a ladder there? Strange, isn't it? Unless it's to feed some other sort of animal. Could be, couldn't it? I haven't seen that before. So I'm mixing this little video with a bit of world events. Of course, it's only a year to Trump, President Trump, President Donald Trump. He's got a stand for, to try and get a second term. They only allowed two terms as president in America. And, uh... I haven't heard, I haven't really come across anyone who wants to replace him yet, so I don't really know what will happen about that. There's some mixed feelings about him, but everyone knows they don't really agree with him, but um, some do. So anyway, we don't know what's happening there. The Queen's getting older. We had the um, Remembrance Sunday um, two days ago, which was very moving, of course. Um, but we're mainly talking about now the Second World War. Before it was always the First World War, right? So the, it's been 75 years or something since the end of the Second World War. And I think now the move will be to 100 years in 25 years' time. I could still be alive um, by then. 100 years since the Second World War it will be in 25 years' time. So basically... They concentrated a lot more on the Second World War, D-Day. Um, they're starting to talk more about the campaign in North Africa and Italy. They who were labelled the D-Day Dodgers, but they were actually in fierce battles. Um, so that's slowly being put right. My dad was, of course, in the 8th Army, Royal Engineers. He used to talk about stuff to me, but I didn't really... Always listen when you're young, you don't. Um, now, I've got to make a decision here. So I don't like the feel of the weather. I don't like the feel of the weather at the moment. Now, I don't know whether to carry on up there. Or go down here. Let me look. That looks a bit like it would take me down. I think I'll go up a bit further. I think I will go up a bit further and take the next turning. I think I will. Yeah, it's changed the weather. Oh, I've just seen a deer, by the way. Two hinds in the ferns there. There's two. I saw their bottoms. Yeah, they're further up now. They're running through the wood. They're running through the wood. Yeah, they've gone now. They were... I spotted them. They were just... They must have heard me. They were sort of there. 
It won't be on, it won't come out on the video because we're moving too fast. They've gone deep in, so they are, there are, oh, they are coming on. I seen it. It wouldn't have come out on the video because I didn't have it on zoom. No, I seen one. More of its body with the, with my naked eye. Cool, I tell you what, enough blowy now, folks. Of course, if I decide I don't want to do it, if it looks like it's going to rain a lot, I'll go back down in the valley in a minute and go back the way I came, more or less. Yeah, so there are deer in here. I think that might be the first time I've seen deer in here for myself. They were moving very fast, though. They could come out on the track in a minute. Yeah, they were up there. I've seen, definitely seen a, quite a big deer. There were two hinds. I think you call them hinds or does. I don't know what you call them, actually. I can't remember. And, uh, yeah, at least I've seen, seen a deer. It's good, isn't it? They heard me coming. Oh, my voice. It's a shame I missed them, though, isn't it? If I'd been a bit quieter, I might have been able to get a picture. They might still come out in front of me, but by the time I've zoomed in, see, they've gone. It's nice out of the wind. I do really want to do the hill fort, really. It's a bit of a mission. I know other people are doing it. It just depends if it's going to rain. Anyway, I'm showing you a bit of the Robera Warren. It's quite a nice view down there. I'll have to go over that way. That's where I'll be heading. Um, eventually. Oh, there's someone with a little poodle coming. Other people coming. Look at that dark wood though. Right everyone, I'm turning around because I'm not doing the far bit up near the area of Outstanding Beauty today so I have got a layer of wood this side of me. Because the weather is a bit uncertain I'm not going right over to what I call where the procession route is. Um, I'm not taking shortcuts, I'm just heading now down this hill towards the base of the hill fort. Now I did see deer. Unfortunately, didn't see them close enough to catch them on the camera. But I've seen them with the naked eye three times. By the time you get the camera focused, um, they move fast and they were running. Um, I could see the back of the hinds or the does, whatever they are, their white bottoms moving as they were running, and then I saw the, the grey body of, of the stag. Um, and I'm quite happy just to have seen it with a naked eye because I don't know if I've actually seen deer in here before. I know they, they do come in here, but I don't think I've actually seen them before. That'll be the first time today. Well, it's, it's unfortunate I couldn't record it. But fortunate for me that I've seen some, so... Yeah, so we're not doing that chunk, because I could have done, gone over there and down. Yeah, but I don't need to do that today. Today I need to get the windscreen wipers views. I need to... 
enjoy the walk as much as I can without worrying about whether I'm going to get drenched. And take some video footage. It's still going to be a three or four hour walk, whatever I do, so... You know. Two people passed me a minute ago. With a little poodle dog. Said hello, you know, like you do. Exchange highs and that sort of thing. And um, I'm, I've taken videos, photos. I'm not on a march. And uh, so they've, they've disappeared now. Way down there somewhere. I think I'll come out in a minute on the track that'll take me towards the hill fort. But like I said, I haven't done this for a while. So, even after a couple of years, you can soon forget. You can soon forget sometimes, like, fine details of a walk. Because there's a little fork coming up now. So, God, it's beautiful. I'm just going to stop again.